一言だけなんて言えるの一言なんかじゃ足りない私は私はまだたくさんともにさんと話したいもっといっぱい言葉を交わしたいハサケそれがいくつなら満足なんだその言葉が一つじゃ足りないならいくつならお前は満足するんだそんなの知らないよ私はただもっとたくさんもっともっとたくさんともにさんと話したいた俺もだえ俺もハサキと話がしたい一言なんかじゃないいくらでも話をしたいだから俺は今夜は一言だけをお前に伝えるためにお前に会いに来たんだえそれって。俺は消えない俺は間宮拓司に勝ってそしてこれからお前を守り続けるトモニーさん刃先を守るのはユキでもそしてマスターでもない刃先俺は帰ってくる必ず帰る<笑>だから安心しろこの釜を倒してそして俺は間宮拓司を倒すこの釜ってあんた師範代に大層な口の聞き方ねしかもそんなボロボロなくせにマスターすみません今のは俺はあんたを倒す足ガクガク震えてるのにむしゃぶるいあんたキャラ変わってるわよ俺いっぱいいっぱいなんでクール系とかやってるわけにもいかないんですよ about time. いっぱいいっぱいならそれらしくしないと But if they keep saying that this is Tomo then how does he fucking lose to Takuji? He was already beaten up He got knocked around by Master before I came And why would he want Yuki to take over? Why do they keep saying that Takuji's the an original body. He was covered in bruises and cuts. Anyway, anyone could see that there was a difference in absolute power here. Like he like they kept saying like Takuji's the first, but unless it's gonna be like oh no, it's Tomo's body. But he died. Quote unquote. So Takuji took over his body, he wanted to live through Takuji because he ended up dying. The situation was desperate, and still he fought on. Shihanbai. Dojo no shi ni wa kana wa na katta n desu yo ne. Uchi no chii sa. So nia, an na no ni kate ru wake nai wa yo. Sengoku jidai kara tsuzuku kono kobujutsu wa hon no su hyak shirei no kihon waza shi ka nai. それの組み合わせが数万という数になるでもあの人はそういう問題じゃなかった動物的感というかまああの道場は宗教的なもの歴代が霊能力者のような力を持っていたそしてそのうち多分それを感じてるんだと思いますさあ整いましたこれから俺の番ですあんたの番夢を扱うことその意味この現実の世界で<笑>トモ兄さん Because there's no reason for Tomo to lose like there just isn't It felt like time stopped in that moment. Time stood still, not moving into the past or the future. Like something that simply exists. The next moment seemed to stretch into eternity. The two silhouettes sprung into motion. Is 
すげえ勝ったんだちょ私の失敗もなあ痛くない痛くないといえば嘘になる I went and got the medicine box. Why did he have to get beaten up right after he came back? He's just like he always was. Every time Tomo comes back to me, it's just like this. Every time you come back, you look like this. I almost said that, and then, but then I stopped. Tomo had no memory of the distant past. He was convinced that he was actually Mami at Takaji, and his personality was just created by Takaji. So Tomo had thrown away all his own mem own memories. And all of our happy days into Sawai Mura too. だから言ってるだろう。お前を守るためだって。でも、これから一緒にいるためだ。これから一緒。あ、そうだ。共に。さん、どこにも行かないの。あ、そうだ。どこにも行かない。だからいくらでも言葉を交わせる。本当にそうかもな。だから本当はガムテープでぐるぐる巻きにしてどこにも行けないようにしたい。それもてかもな。うん。友兄さんを信じる。私何度も裏切られてるけど私は友兄さんを信じる。なんでだよ。こんなダメな兄を。だって、友兄さんは私のヒーローだから。ヒーロー？そうだよ。ヒーローは救世主より強いんだよ。なんだよそれ。出たら目なり靴だな。でもそうなんだもん。あ、そうだ
でどこにいるの木村さんは聞いてないですかうんどこに行くか聞いてないなあちょっとどこかじゃなくて知らないだけじゃないですかいやーそうなるかなああれ人影えどどこ There on the moonlit rooftop. There's only one to the wet. There was one person. But it looked like he was facing off against some adversary. A statue underneath the moon. A lone figure. Something at his chest glinted and gleamed. The hand held in front of his chest grasped the same knife from before. It was the same pose as the one seven years ago. The only difference was that a single figure stood in the, the darkness, not two. The knife stepped was aimed at his own heart. I saw his face in the shadow and I instantly knew who it was. There's only one person in the world who could make that expression a mixture of kindness and irritation. I forgot to lock the door when I was about to commit suicide. I thought I was supposed to commit suicide. Damn it! Damn so this does answer my question if he was just going to stab himself. In that moment when Tomo was worrying about me, his expression changed for just a split second. For a split second, his expression changed into someone else's. I tried to scream, but it ended up before I could get the scream out of my mouth. That thing ended. Like fibers cracking on, uh, upon steel, then blood and flesh. The sound rang out, lonesome in the dark. The dirge of the end. It was a messenger telling me that this was the end. Cold iron flashed in the dark. Bright red blood danced across the blade. An endless jet black sky hung over our heads. The moon tinted our lacquer sky with shades of blue. The steel flashed. The red blood flowed. Everything turned white. All I could see was white. Who, those words ne I never could say. Those words I never could hold back. All those words caught in my throat, and then my breath came out as a scream. <coughs> I could only scream. Tears ran down my face as I screamed for him. <laughs> Tomo whispered as if he was talking to himself. He must have been talking to Takaji. I can tell what had happened to them. All I knew was uh, Nissan had stabbed himself in the chest with a knife. As a result of that action, no one could be the victor. If his physical body died, it would mean the death of three th souls. Why did it have to come to this? I crumbled and fell on the spot. My voice caught up in my throat. My, the tears won't stop. The trembling won't go away. It's a little late for that. Nara. 
受け入れるだけか<笑>こんなことなら最後の時間もっと他に使えばよかったかなもっと相手してやればよかったな yeah, probably. <笑>ダメな兄だな。全く変わらないな。さてと。お別れだ。もみやたくじ。おめでとう。そして。俺の。負けだ。I ran over to Tomo. I put my arms around him and held him close. たまにいさ。行かないで。バカ。俺に近づくな。危ないぞ。肉体はマミやタクシーのものに変わる。俺は消える。タマ兄さんが消えるなんてありえないよ。そうだな。消えたくないな。もっとハサキと。そうだよ。だからタマ兄さん、一緒に一緒に帰ろう。そうだな。それが約束だったな。The flower I saw on the hill that night. I saw the sun of the night on a road I never passed by. In a world ruled by the azure, the sunflowers shone bright, and bright with yellow. I told him about the sunflowers. The sunflowers on the hill. I knew that sun in the night because we'd seen that same sun together before. Tomo gently laughed. It's a little late for that. <laughs> Nissan pushed me away and stood on his own two feet. Ah,、oh, crazy ass. <laughs> you stabbed me, you Harlandon. <laughs> I tried to stop him, but he slapped away my hand. His face was different from before. His voice was different. He looked precisely the same, yet it was like he was completely a different person. 
As he stood up there in the moonlight, he looked like a vengeful demon back from the grave. Oh, no shit, buddy. ダメだ。あれは友さねくんじゃない。君を殺そうとした男だ。兄さん。兄さん。危険だ。ダメだ。君が一番知っているだろう。今彼の下には百数十人もの信者がいる。兄さん。兄さん。ダメだ。危険だ
He just looked at me. His eyes were full of hate. Just like they were back then. この波動の発生源が二人して、この子のことこの箱舟に乗り込んでくるとはな。兄さん、なんでなんでタクズ兄さんは共兄さんをそうやって。なるほど、勇気のあの行動。あの異常な強さ。そうか。お母さんが設定したハードルにしては高すぎると思ったんだよ。あいつ強すぎだろ。お前たちか。お前たち黒波動の発生源が奴に力を貸していたのか。<笑> シロハドウのリルルが僕を助けたようになるほど大人たちが言っていたのはそういうことかなるほど破壊者ねなるほど勇気はお前らによって作られた救世主を破壊する黒波動の闇救世主 人類の救済を妨げる存在。それで全ての合点が行く。あれほどの強さ。これほど僕を追い詰めた理由も合点が行く。だが残念ながら結果はこれだ。闇の救世主は死んだ闇の救世主が消滅しそして真の救世主である僕が残ったこの地上に僕の勝ちだそうだ僕の勝ち闇と光の戦い白波動と黒波動の戦いは僕らの勝利だ白波動の勝利救世主の勝利なんで届かないのなんで I have no idea because I need to know what happened 気が済んだでしょ。タクジ兄さん。もう。消えろ。消えて。お願い。お前こそ消えろ。黒波動を止めろ。タクジ兄さん。黒波動を止めないのなら仕方がない強制消去だ人を呼べはい何ですか誰でもいい男数人をここに呼べ The reasonable response 